Hi, we are learning three digit numbers. In this video, we will see how to compare three digit numbers. Okay, to start with, I will take two three digit numbers. So, for example, we have 619 and 521. We need to find out which number is bigger. I will tell you a very simple rule to identify which number is bigger or smaller. Here are the rules. First, compare number of digits in both the numbers. In 619, we have 1, 2 and 3 digits. And in 521, we have 1, 2 and 3 digits. As both these numbers have equal number of digits, that is 3. So, we move to second rule. When both the numbers have equal number of digits, then compare the numbers at the hundreds place. The number having greater hundreds place value will be the greater number. Let us see, in 619, we have 6 at the hundreds place and in 521, we have 5 at the hundreds place. As 6 is bigger than 5, so 619 will be bigger than 521. I will place open crocodile face towards the bigger number which is 619. Okay, now what will happen if both the numbers have same digits at the hundreds place? Let us take one more example. Let us compare 365 and 382. Here both these numbers have 3 at the hundreds place. So we cannot decide which number is bigger. In this case we will compare tens digit in both the numbers. The number having greater tens place value will be the bigger number. In 365 we have 6 at the tens place and in 382 we have 8 at the tens place. As 8 is bigger than 6, so 382 will be bigger than 365. I will place an open crocodile face towards the bigger number that is 382. Now what will happen if both the numbers have same digits at the hundreds place and tens place both. In that case, we will compare their ones digits. The number having greater ones digit will be the bigger number. Let us take one more example. In this example, we are comparing 456 and 451. As you can see, both these numbers have 4 at the hundreds place and 5 at the tens place. So, we will compare their ones digits. In 456, we have 6 at the ones place and in 451, we have 1 at the tens place. As 6 is bigger than 1, so 456 is bigger than 451. I will place an open crocodile face towards 456. This is the bigger number. Okay, you may also ask what will happen if both the numbers have all three digits same. In that case, both numbers will be equal. Okay, same way you can identify smaller numbers. For example, let us find out which number is smaller between 437 and 353. In this example also, first we need to identify if both the numbers have equal number of digits. If both the numbers have equal number of digits, then we will compare the digits at the hundreds place first and decide which is smaller. In this example, 3 is smaller than 4. So, 353 is a smaller number compared to 437. So, I will place smaller than symbol towards 353. This is smaller than symbol because 353 is uh, smaller. So, I have put this symbol towards 353. Okay, now consider if both the numbers have same digits at the hundreds place. Then, 
we compare their tens digits and decide which number is smaller. As in this example, we have 5 at the hundreds place in both the numbers. So, we will compare their tens place value, these two numbers. As 3 is smaller than 8, so 532 is a smaller number than 582. I will place smaller than symbol towards 532. Okay. Now consider if both the numbers have same digits at the hundreds place and at the tens place as well. Then we compare their digits at the ones place. As in this example, both the numbers have same digits at the hundreds place that is 7. Also, both the numbers have same digits at the tens place as well that is 3. So, we will compare their digits at the ones place. As 1 is smaller than 9, so 731 is a smaller number than 739. I will place smaller than symbol towards 731. Okay, hope you understood this concept. In my next video, I will bring more examples. Thanks for watching.